A year ago, Florence Griffith Joyner was just starting to pay serious attention to the women's 100 meters. Fabulous record of 10.49. Many say it will never be broken, but Dawn Sowell is already the one people are talking about as the new Flojo. A lot of pressure on her based on her recent double victory at the NCAA Championships 100 and 200 meters. Her teammate at LSU, Esther Jones, a sprinter many people talk about for the future, and ex-LSU runner Sheila Eccles was a gold medalist in Seoul in the 4x100 meter relay. And Danette Young, also a gold medalist from Seoul, running as an alternate on that relay. In the middle of the track, it's Dawn Sowell, who's adopted a bit of the flair of Flojo with a full-length bodysuit. She and Eccles alongside of her are good starters. At the start, it was Eccles who had a great start, but it was Sowell who showed her characteristic acceleration midway through the race and just pulled away from the field. Very tired Dawn Sowell. She had to run six races at the recent NCAA championships in Provo. She says she's ready for a little bit of a rest. Her coach, Lauren Seagrave, tells his athletes they should try to rip up the track in the first few strides. Sheila Eccles gets a much better start than Dawn Sowell, Look how composed Sowell is as she reaches the middle of the race. Totally relaxed in the face and tremendous stride length as she goes towards the finish line. Sowell, like Leroy Burrell, a collegiate runner, dominating the sprints at the TAC Championships in Houston. Her recent 10.7800 meters made her the third American woman in history behind Flojo and Evelyn Ashford. Here, her 10.91 establishes a new meet record. Eccles in second, Jones in third, Let's go to Craig.